So let's talk about gripping your rifle with your support hand. There are a lot of trains of thought when it comes to gripping your rifle and the quick and easy answer is there is no specific way for all situations. What you need to do is you need to set up your rifle and you need to be able to train to adapt to many different types of shooting situations such as long range versus short range, shooting in many different positions like crone sitting, squatting, kneeling, um, shooting from like a modified prone, shooting around cover, on cover, and of course offhand shooting. So because of all that stuff, your grip is gonna change on the rifle. And one of my best pieces of advice that I can give regarding using your support hand is set up your rifle in a way that makes it flow with your support hand. That's why this rifle here is very simple. I do not have any grips of any kind on the front, on the hand guard. Uh, everything is set up very simple and to the point, and that is because it allows my hand to flow very easily on the rifle. Starting back at the magwell position, we know that this isn't the greatest for close quarters because your muzzle is going to have a little bit less control. But this does work well for extended hold of the rifle because I can hold the rifle right here using my bone and muscle support. I can do it for a longer time than I could with my hand extended out. Um, this is also great for long range shooting, one round at a time. It allows for a good bone and mass support to take accurate shots. As I move my hand up the hand guard, this becomes more of a close quarters type hold. This, I can steer the rifle, I can drive the rifle very well, I'm very fast with it. This is great for close quarters work, working around objects, cover, concealment, all that good stuff. But you do fatigue. Then there's all the different positions within. Uh, some of you may have seen stuff like Marines and shooters doing service match shoots. They'll hold the rifle like this. Or they'll hold the rifle like this. And it just depends on the person. There's a lot of different ways to hold a rifle. Don't get so caught up in one specific way. Just outfit your rifle in a way that makes it flow with how you want to do things and then practice it all. So again, don't discount the mag hold. This is great for long range type stuff. Don't discount this, of course. This may not be the best for consistent long range because you will fatigue fast, but this is great for close quarters type stuff. Then you have everything in between. So try it out. Look at all the different holds for a rifle. Don't be dogmatic and stick to just one for everything. Really look how your handguard is set up. If you have a whole bunch of stuff on your handguard, ask yourself, is it mission essential? Is it something I need? to run the rifle how I want to run it. So with that said, thanks a lot for watching and as always, stay safe.